Let me show you. The internal structure of a dual clutch transmission. Inside, besides the gears, there are mainly the shift forks. You can simply think of it as, two manual transmissions combined. The main difference from a manual is that, shifting and clutching, are fully controlled by the computer. These two transmissions have two input shafts, take a look, one controls the even gears, 2, 4, 6, and reverse, the other controls the odd gears, 1, 3, 5, 7. The two input shafts are each controlled separately by two clutch packs, and connected. When the transmission computer receives a shift command, the computer uses the wiring harness to activate the solenoids. The solenoids then redirect the oil flow. The redirected oil pressure enters behind this hydraulic cylinder, pushing the small piston inside to move left and right. This small piston then pushes the shift fork to engage the gear, moving left and right. All gear engagements are handled by this small piston. But how do we know if the gear is engaged? Look, this is the position sensor. This position sensor sends a feedback signal to the computer, whether it's engaged or not. The computer learns this through the sensor. Now, look at these two large solenoids. They control the two clutch packs respectively when we release the brake and prepare to creep forward. One of these solenoids starts to slowly supply oil to the clutch, enabling creep. Once the vehicle is moving and speed builds up, the computer calculates based on these speed sensors. These at the back are all speed sensors. Using the speed sensors and the throttle position, which is how deeply the accelerator is pressed. If it reaches the shift point, it will command one of the solenoids to release its oil pressure immediately and engage the other. In simple terms, the two clutch packs, one releases, one engages. When it reaches the next shift point, one releases and the other engages again. It's this ongoing cycle. Just get a basic idea for now. If you don't get it, folks, hit that follow button. We'll keep updating with more great content. Thanks for watching. Thank you all.